What's up? My name is Tech Number here for Triple Shoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll be showing you how to fix controller issues that you could be having with Spider-Man Miles Morales on PC. The game's available on Steam and probably a few other platforms, but the solutions in this video should work for pretty much all of them, except for where I specifically state what platform they're for. First of all, obviously you want to make sure that your controller is compatible with the game. If it's a new-ish Xbox 360 or PlayStation 3 and above controller, things will probably work practically guaranteed, or at least they should for the most part. And of course, if it's plugged in via USB, try and swap around what USB you're using. If it's a wireless controller that connects via Bluetooth or something, try using a wired connection if possible. Now, for a weird little tip that applies to all platforms, but only if you have Steam installed. Yes, that's right, a Steam setting affects all platforms, even platforms that aren't Steam. Over here, I have Spider-Man Miles Morales on Steam, but it doesn't really matter if you have it here or not. What you need to do is click Steam in the top left, then head down to Settings, and inside of here, you'll head across to Controller. Then click General Controller Settings, and inside of the little big picture window that's just opened up, you'll see Xbox and PlayStation, as well as Switch configuration support. You'll be ticking or unticking these, whatever the opposite of what you currently have is for whatever controller you currently have. If you have an Xbox One controller that's not working properly and this is unticked, tick it. If it's ticked, untick it. Then you can hit back, OK, and things should hopefully be working properly. If you own the game on Steam, you can right click it, choose properties, then under the controller section here, you can choose disable Steam input, otherwise leave it as default or even enable. One of these options is more than likely going to help you if Steam is causing the issue here. Now at this point, things are probably working properly. However, if they're not, you can choose to use third-party software to try and fix your controller where things aren't working properly. For this, I'd recommend researching DS number four Windows, all of that one word, and X360CE. Basically, those bits of software allow you to remap controller inputs, but they could also help improve compatibility with the game. And with that comes the end of this relatively quick video. Hopefully, you found your answer here. Thank you all for watching. My name's been Techno here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.